JC at Motorcycle Superstore with Revit's Sand 2 jacket. Now we've got it paired with the Sand 2 pants. This is an ultimate combination for adventure touring. Obviously they're sold individually, but let's go over the jacket here. Very high tech, very high end. It costs quite a bit of money, but with that you get a lot of jacket. And one of the things you notice about this right off the bat is that it's very adjustable and it's very adaptable to the different types of climates you might be riding in. So it's got a touring style fit. This is a size large. Neil's 5'9", 180 pounds. I'm in hair under six foot, 180 pounds. We both would wear this jacket. It's very comfortable in this sizing. Uh, sizing does range from small all the way through four extra large. So definitely something to fit your body type. Now, as far as the adjustability goes that we talked about, you've got adjustability on the arms. You can cinch it down on the forearm. Also adjustability on the bicep. You have adjustability here underneath, double straps on both sides of the hips and waist. This is really great at sucking in that any extra material and keep it from flapping around in the wind. Also, you'll find that the sand too, one of the reasons it's different from the original sand jacket is that it has this really long zipper. This is a great amount of adjustability in terms of venting. So you've got all this vent option. You can see that mesh underneath to allow air to flow up into the jacket. More vents on the chest. Lots of airflow pumping through there and on the back side as well. You've got adjustable vents on each side and this is actually a vent as well. Now this serves several purposes. It can open up as a vent and on the exhaust or it actually accepts a hydration pack. So this is set up to work with a camelback of some sort. You put the bladder in there and you've also got a loop here and you can hook that up so that your, your drink hose actually routes up to the front of the jacket. Now, some other things about this. This thing has a serious amount of liners on the inside. Basically, you've got three different styles of liner. You can see here, the first one we get to, this is the Hydrotex 3 waterproof liner. It's a breathable membrane. It's got double storm flaps that use snaps and a zipper. This thing is a full length liner and that's what's going to keep you dry on the inside. On the bottom end, they've got this thing attached by 12 snaps on each cuff. So, a little bit of overkill there, but it's definitely not going anywhere once you get the liner installed. Underneath that, you can see the next layer. This is your quilted liner. This is for keeping the heat in when it's cold outside. This uses the short zipper, comes in and out. It can be used without this waterproof liner installed. You can see the waterproof liner uses the full length zipper. So there's a lot of different combinations you can run with this. Also, this is good for cold weather, wet weather, but you can use this jacket in hot weather as well. It does accept the Challenger cooling vest. That thing will zip right in using those shorty zippers. And then you can have nice, cool performance when you're out there riding in the summertime. Okay, so some other things about this jacket is the storage. Lots of pockets on it. You've got these nice cargo pockets on the exterior. Again, double flap to keep the moisture out. Also, behind that, You've got your standard pockets. These have a nice fleece lining, very comfortable, plenty of room to keep what you need to keep stored on the jacket. On the interior, you have interior pockets, and if you've got your liners installed, you can still use those. You've got a zip-in pocket, and you have another one on the inside of the quilted liner as well. So, plenty of room to keep your stuff safe and to keep it dry if you have these installed in order to keep the rain at bay. Another thing that they've done for the sand too is they've made it uh, adjustable so that you can use it with a neck brace. It works with the Liat neck brace system. So if you really want to go hardcore off-road, this thing's going to work for that as well. You can see that underneath this, there is some armor built in for safety. You've got CE approved armor in the shoulders and on the elbows. Uh, on the exterior, you've got different types of textile materials, including ballistics. So it's going to be very resistant to tearing. On the back side of this, you have a fully perforated EVA foam pad. So that's gonna help flow air through and it's also going to allow you to upgrade. If you wanna go with higher spec armor, you can upgrade that and get a little bit more protection that way. Another feature, since we're on the back, I missed this pocket. This is the huge cargo pocket. Great for stuffing things like tools, water bottles. You can see it's got these sewn in pleats that allow for extra expansion. Really a very versatile jacket that can carry all that you need to carry when you're out on your adventure touring ride. Check it out, different sizes like I mentioned, also different colors available as well. You can always pair this thing up with the Sand Pro glove, the pants, the high vis connector, HV vest, lots of things going on with this to make it an ultimate adventure touring setup. Check them out at MotorcycleSuperstore.com for more information and pictures and be sure to subscribe to us on YouTube for more Revit product videos.